click the bell icon to get latest videos from ekida hello friends today we'll discuss one question on primary distribution of overheads based on some suitable parameters let us read the question A factory has three production departments P1 P2 P3 and two service departments S1 S2 so in all there are five departments out of this three are production departments and two departments are service departments the following overheads and other information are extracted from the books for the month of January 2014 rent 6000 repair 3600 depreciation 2700 lighting 600 supervision 9000 fire insurance clearly they have given fire insurance for stock 3000 esi contribution this is statutory contribution by employer for welfare of the workers that is based on employees state insurance power 5400 parameter 1 they have given about area of square feet p department 400 square feet p2 department 300 square feet p3 department 270 square feet s1 150 square feet and s2 80 square feet now this is a floor area some expenses are directly based on the floor area so we can allocate them in the ratio of floor area occupied for example rent it will be allocated based on floor area number of workers that is the second parameter we have based on the number of workers we can allocate certain expenses production department 1 is having 54 workers 2 48 workers production department 3 36 workers service department s1 is having 24 workers and s2 is having 18 workers so we are required to calculate ratio of number of workers third we have wages production department 1 18000 production department 2 15000 3 12000 service department 1 9000 service department 2 6000 as far as wages are considered of production departments it will not be considered as overheads we are allocating them charging absorbing them as an independent expense that is direct labor but in case of service departments the amount of wages will be treated as amount of overheads and it will be divided among the departments accordingly value of plant production department 1 72000 production department 2 54000 348000 and service departments are having plant service department 16000 in in case of service department 2 in case of service department 2 there is no plant so we are required to take ratio of plant to allocate expense like depreciation stock value production department 1 45000 production department 2 27000 production department 3 18000 there is no question of stock in service department because service department don't deal in stocks in case of production departments they are having a stock therefore they are going to take insurance of the stock so insurance policy if it is taken we are required to pay insurance premium so the amount of insurance premium paid if it is comprehensive it is taken together then it will be allocated between the department based on stock value here we have fire insurance for stock rupees 3000 it will be divided in the ratio of 45 is to 27 is to 18 horse power of plant this parameter will be used to allocate the expense of power that is given 5400 it will be divided in the ratio of 600 is to 400 is to 300 is to 150 is to 50 allocate or apportion the overheads among the various departments on suitable 
basis. We are required to record all expenses here in first column. Rent will be allocated in the area of occupied by the departments. It is in the ratio of 400 is to 300 is to 270 is to 150 is to 80. So we can calculate the ratio. It will be rupees 2000 for production department 1, 1500 for production department 2, 1350 for production department 3, 750 for service department 1, rupees 400 for service department 2 next we have repairs it will be allocated based on value of plant so it will be in the ratio of 72000 is to 54000 is to 48000 is to 6000 service department 2 don't have any plant so no such expenses will be divided for service department number 2 1440 for production department 1, 1080 for production department 2, 960 for production department 3, 120 for service department 1. Next we have lighting, it will be allocated based on area square fit next depreciation it will be allocated based on value of plant There will be no depreciation for service department 2 as it is not having any value of plant. Next we have supervision 9000. It will be allocated in the ratio of number of workers. Next we have fire insurance for stock, it will be allocated based on stock value.
Next we have ESI contribution. It will be allocated based on wages. Next we have power 5400. It will be allocated in the ratio of horsepower of plant. We have considered all expenses. We are required to have special attention to wages. It is given for all departments, but we are required to consider only for service departments, 9,000 and 6,000, because direct wages in case of service department should be treated as overheads, whereas wages of production departments should not be treated as overheads. Wages of service department 1 and 2, it is total 15,000. It will have share only in case of service department 9,000 and 6,000 on actual basis. Wages of production departments should not be included in these columns. We have recorded all expenses. Now we'll be taking total. Thus, we have distributed overheads on certain parameters, which is called as primary distribution of production overheads. Thanks for watching this video. Stay in tune with Ikeda and subscribe to our channel Ikeda. Thank you.